in this video I'm going to give a quick overview of the importance of a micron gauge. It's something everybody should have in their arsenal of air conditioning tools uh, if you want to do a good job. If you just want to blow and go collect money and don't care, then skip this video because you just want minimum. But if you want to know things that you've never known before, a uh, micron gauge is actually a, a, a central tool that should always be used. So if you want a more in depth, go search for one of my videos that I go in more in depth in the micron. This is for people who just might be finding this video right now and do not even know what a micron is, which is okay. Today is your day to learn a new word, a new tool, and a new meter. Uh, you could get these built into your refrigerant gauges. That's okay, but that's not the preferred way. It's always good to have a second backup and it's always good to have a remotely mounted one. So as you can see here, I have the fitting on the high side. I have an on-off valve right here that I can actually distach the airflow through a Schrader valve in here when I back this out so no pressure or oil will get inside here. I have the refrigerant line for refrigerant hooked up to the field piece wireless Bluetooth scale that goes to here and it'll tell me how much refrigerant comes out have the field piece 8 CFM vacuum pump and the vacuum is actually going to one hose three quarter inch vacuum rated silicone hose as you can see right back there and as you can see that's no little quarter inch diameter hose that's going through there so we're about to fill this up and so I'm going to shut off the flow to the gauge and separate it so no refrigerant goes back up into the gauge. This is an extra little valve T right here that performs that task, so right there. Right now I just backed out the depressor and now the valve core is now isolated and separated so nothing can get up to the micron gauge. So now my refrigerant flow is going to be controlled by this valve right here so I have that on I have this depressed let's depress you don't want to put refrigerant back up your vacuum uh, pump so I just backed off I'm backing off the valve back here there we go so now when I put refrigerant in it won't back up I'm zeroed out if you really want to test it you can put some, here's a glove, 20 grams, let's take the glove off, it went back to zero grams, you know it's working, you know sometimes gauges, uh, scales could lock up on you, so in this application we have a 2.4, 2.4, if we look over there, it says 2.4 is 900 grams, so right there 2.4, 900 grams, dual AC system, this has two evaporators, so let's watch the scale. Let's see how long this takes. We're gonna put two pounds, which is nearly uh, 900 grams. So, let's get that out of the way. Okay, watch my fingers. I'm on the scale right here. One, two, three, go. And we're going in. We want 900 grams. When you do a nice, good, complete vacuum, all your refrigerant goes in at one time. No problem at all. You're using all the gas laws to your benefit, and you know how to go around now. There we go, time to shut off. Boom. And 910, 920, a little will be left behind in the tube. And that was 907. So I could live with that. And now let's start this vehicle up. Okay, and uh, actually I'm really liking uh, the Infracon DTEC Stratus leak detector. Very handy. All right, I'll get back later when I have the sensors hooked up, the cars running and everything like that. Still got to purge a little coolant. They didn't have all the coolant. I gotta make sure I purge out the last of the air. And 8 CFM vacuum pump field piece. Very good for you who are first watching this uh, video channel and you just stumble upon it. 
Silicone deep vacuum hose, three quarter inch. Shut off T, shut off T. And a micron gauge, blue vac, plus pro. When you uh, look up this part number or this part, blue vac, make sure you get the plus pro. This is the one that you could tie into your software on a computer, a laptop, a PDA, and you can actually data log and record your pull down of your vacuum.